the Z is down. I figured since it's already down, might as well make the best of it and start on some projects that I was postponing. Um, the first of that is my spoiler. I wanted to make a custom spoiler because for the longest time it's just this stubby Z spoiler that everyone has. So I'm going to mold it and create my own. Now, the Z running, um, that's going to take a bit. I have to wait for the valve covers to come in the mail um, because if you know a Z you have to replace the valve covers when something like this happens um, so we're gonna be doing that I ordered new headlights they were the wrong ones because I have the halogens and I ordered the HIDs so I'm gonna return those and get new ones so it also doesn't have headlights right now um, but you know what it's a project car and it's gonna come out better than ever. Okay, so now, theoretically, that should expand up to like one inch, so it's gonna look a lot different than what it is right now. Um, I guess we just wait. So, uh, it's coming along, and, uh, I got this. Okay, so, I've done a lot. Um, it is the night of that I started the video. I have taken, you know, let me just show you the stuff I've done. Taking the intake off, the lower plenum, the upper plenum. Down here, I've blocked off this so nothing can fall in. Taking the wiring harness and put that there. Took everything apart. Now for the spark plug tubes that were filled with oil, um, I should probably get a uh, Nobel Peace Prize for this. Um, I took this uh, turkey baster, I don't know what they're called, um, and then taped the end with a straw. And I was able to actually stick it down in there and get all the oil out. So, yeah, that's great. 
Um, now I'm just going to continue. Um, I'm gonna tell you, I'll keep you guys updated. been a while um I didn't film much just because it was a lot of work and a lot of stress but it's finished the Z is running great after I did the valve covers the Z still wasn't starting up how I wanted it to it was taking a while um, and then a check engine light came on I figured it was probably the crankshaft position sensors so I ordered all three of the sensors from Z1 Motorsports and it starts up no problem now um, let me just show you the aftermath and everything I've done one two three old sensors engine put back together completely new headlights just came in today still got work to do on those they do work though I plugged them in to make sure and this is how I'm doing on the spoiler Okay, so a lot done. I have sanded and cut out the shape of the spoiler and how that's gonna look. Um, there's not much to do. Now I'm just going to fiberglass it and everything. I'm gonna show you the spoiler real quick and then just cut to me fiberglassing, priming, sanding, painting.
The spoiler's finished. It looks super sick. Just kidding. No, it doesn't. It looks like ass. I'm throwing it away. <laughs>